Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to force nest uh, to use the alternative heat instead of the um, primary uh, or, or your own, um, heat pump. So um, the reason you would do, you would want to do that is for for my uh, for my house there is a heat pump and there is a, which is you know the condenser compressor. You got an outside unit that exchanges heat from outside to inside. Uh, in, that, in the case of it, it's not working for, for me right now, for example, it's, uh, I think the, the pressure is low or something, so it's, it will never heat up the house. Uh, so you can turn on the alternative heat um, if you have one, and the way you do it is if you go to settings, go all the way to equipment, And then click continue, click on test, select alternative heat, select done, done, and done. And you can just go click continue, done, get out of there, and you'll see it's using alternative heat. Um, another, another way to do this, uh, so this will, keep, I think, keep alternative heat on until you reach the temperature. So I have mine set at 73. Um, another way to do this, which the Nest people actually told me how to do this, and it took them a while to figure it out how how they should do uh, how I can do it. But eventually, after half an hour on the phone, they told me to do this. So if you go back to the equipment, continue. Um, continue and just select dual fuel and uh, this will let you select you can force the temperature so you can actually move up the temperature to like always use out and uh, if you select that click done you'll always use alternate heat for your heat so it won't use the compressor and condenser uh, and that's all for the video thank you bye, -bye.